I'm 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 ready. Okay. Uh, so synthesis of and use uses of ammonia. Uh, you know ammonia is very. Im, uh, if you know, then it's it's fine. But if you don't know, ammonia is very important because of the uh, its large applicability. So uh, different types of uh, fertilizer uh, that you can produce from ammonia. So if you ask one chem chemistry student that or any chemical related like faculty, so what is ammonia? They will show you this structure. So you should be familiar with that. But uh, before that, I want to ask you guys that did you ever smell ammonia? Everyone, you didn't smell ever. No, you are uh, you are a liar or you are <laughs> ignorant. <laughs> Otherwise, you should appeal that yes, because the smell of ammonia, uh, everybody smell it because the pungent smell of urine that is due to the ammonia because they are ammonia, urea, uric acid. But the smell majorly coming from the uh, ammonia. The main use of ammonia, we can see the fertilizer. 85% ammonia is utilized for uh, preparation of fertilizer. So uh, I should not be point out that fertilize how much fertilizer is important in our day to day life because otherwise our half of the population will be starved because if you didn't put any fertilizer in the plant then you will not harvest any crops. So besides the fertilizer there are some other use like explosive textiles that I will uh, going to point out later. Like textile, in the textile case, you need to uh, preserve the textile and hot on. For that, you need to use the uh, bad smell of ammonia. So, for the explosive preparation of different types of explosive, and also in the rocket fuel, right now, different types of azide or ammonia is getting used here uh, for the rocket fuel because there are three hydrogen can see uh, in the structure so that is that's why ammonia is used in the rocket fuel we go back to uh, main use of the fertilizer mainly the fertilizer is ammonium sulfate or ammonium phosphate from if, if you don't know the structure or anything still you can understand that there is some ammonia because it's the formation is ammonium so there is some ammonia uh, other uses of the textile explosive rocket fuel i have already mentioned so, how we can prepare the ammonia? So, the existing process, the name of the uh, name reaction that is called Hebert Boss process, that is so important uh, that both of the inventors, Hebert and Boss, both uh, are nominated and also got uh, awarded the Nobel Prize for this reaction. This is uh, Hebert Boss process, it looks like very cool hydrogen and hydrogen getting inserted there after the ammonia will be uh, in presence of catalyst they will form the ammonia and from the uh, hydrogen and nitrogen you will get only the product that is ammonia but it's not that cool so it's very complicated reaction but the outline of this reaction is very simple this is professor Heber and professor Bosch uh, again it is one German chemist, Professor Heber, won Nobel Prize in 1918 for synthesis of ammonia. And uh, Professor uh, again, the Professor Boss is also a German chemist and engineer. Engineer, he also received the Nobel Prize for large scale synthesis of ammonia. So, such that we can apply this strategy to large scale, like in industrial scale. So, that's why both of them won Nobel Prize. What are the raw material for ammonia? You know the hydrogen, nitrogen and metal catalyst. So how can we get the raw material for preparation of ammonia? Hydrogen, that's uh, not too easily available, but nitrogen in our nature, you know, 79% of our atmosphere is ni uh, uh, nitrogen, for this nitrogen. Why nitrogen is so high, I will discuss in my later slide. Uh, this is hydrogen, you can see the percentage of uh, hydrogen is very low in our atmosphere. So we need to uh, uh, figure out some another way such that we can, uh, we can 
abstract ammonia or syn uh, hydrogen or synthesize the hydrogen uh, source of hydrogen so what is the uh, what is the second uh, alternative source that will be stream reforming process that is one complicated process why nitrogen is so high in our atmosphere because uh, nitrogen has bigger molecular weight much more mass so it will not be uh, due to the centripetal force of our heart it will be quite on uh, in uh, that will not, not be far away from the atmosphere steam deforming process this is steam deforming process for that you need to use the natural gas uh, and after that you will produce hydrogen and carbon dioxide but carbon dioxide you know that is the uh, what is called i mean the due to the earth warming that is i mean greenhouse gas that's why it's not good for our environment so uh, and also the natural gas will be one day will be totally way out so we need to think from earlier carbon dioxide that is greenhouse gas and also if you want to produce one ton hydrogen for, in this process you need to produce 13 ton carbon dioxide that is not good for our environment and most of the thing and also uh, the oil is uh, produced in, in per year the energy that is produced uh, I mean globally uh, one person is consumed for this process so but still people are trying to do uh, following this process because the ammonia is very important so what is the alternative process we are trying to use vinegar that is on acid and nitrogen we can abstract from the nature and after that we can form the ammonia so this is uh, are this only thing that we need for ammonia? No, we need some metal catalyst. What catalyst we need? Uh, what is catal catalyst? So for the normal reaction, you can see the reaction is too slow. But when you are adding the catalyst, it will be like whistle bolt. So it will be within a second. So what catalyst we need? I have shown this catalyst before. So it is very means very big structure and horrible structure so I can represent it with this thing so what do we need finally we want catalyst, nitrogen and acid after that we can from prepare the ammonia which summary ammonia is extremely useful in daily life mainly in fertilizer, textiles, rocket fuel that are the other uses nitrogen is easily available in nature but hydrogen is not available uh, Hydrogen production with the ex expensive stream reforming process. Uh, in the stream reforming process, we are producing greenhouse gases. So the alternative approach is uh, replacing hydrogen with the different types of acid and pincer complex. Uh, why catalyst to speed up the reaction? Thank you. Is there any question? Taking the vapor of ammonia in higher concentration, that time you may uh, produce tears and also uh, your esophagus can produce some types of like irritation that can happen. If you are taking, uh, like, it, 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 it's not quite obvious that whenever you are working with ammonia, you will not intake that much ammonia, okay. but that is not good enough to irritate you. But uh, otherwise, it doesn't have. If you uh, intake it, then it will. Yes, it, will, it will be hazardous. Any chemical uh, rather than water, if you will take too much or like that, it will have quite a Otherwise, it's good. Any other questions for Paul? Okay, thank you, Paul.